What's up everybody, this is DDS and in this video I am going to be talking about the Complete Control MK2. My thoughts on it approximately one month after receiving it. Once again, before I get started on the thing, Native Instruments, McBenjamins, I appreciate you. All that you do, I really appreciate it. And um, yeah, let me get started. You know, I have my Complete Control MK1 over there, or Mach 1, whichever you prefer to call it. And I didn't really use it that much. I used it sometimes. I got it when it first came out. When it first came out, I was using it all the time and stuff like that. But then over time, I started just using the machine from the majority of my beats. But I must say, with this, in this edition, like this Mach 2, MK2, whatever you want to call it, like it's changed like a lot. Like I enjoy going through here, browsing my sounds, seeing everything up here on the screens, being able to just visualize everything and then on top of that I actually started making beats only on the keyboard I never did that before I would get load my drum kit up go to key mode and just play around with it like I'm playing on the machine go around and hit the art button and then roll my hi-hats and stuff like I'm using no repeat and it's really opened up so much for me and then with the pitch wheels and modulation wheel didn't have that on the MK1 what you had was the smart strips and since I got one of the first ones that came out back then, like I stood in line, not even standing in line, I made sure to call um, the Tar Center when they first opened, like I'm on my way, please hold one for me. The first day it released, I noticed the issue with it, it was sticking when you would go with the smart strips. Well, you don't have that issue no more, that's all I was trying to say. And it makes me want to use these mod wheels and pitch wheels even more now. And the fact that I can arrange my tracks right here on the machine, not the machine, excuse me, on the complete control on the keyboard is dope. Like, I love it. It's so much fun to me. Like, just going through, if I play this idea, let me go ahead and hit this. I did a piano piece. And what I did with the piano piece was I played it, pattern, next. All right, let me build up right here. Okay, you know what? I want to have that go back to how it was in the first one. Let me duplicate that. No need to turn around and touch nothing else. I've used this, and this has opened up my creativity to doing different things. You know, I I do play the keys on the machine sometimes, well, the majority of the time, but now I've started doing this, and it's really opened up my creativity to different things, different types of music. All right, so I don't know what just happened. It's something with this camera sometimes, I guess. I need to look into it. Maybe it's the memory card, but sometimes my videos freeze, but that's <coughs> besides the point. The video has stopped, so what I was saying was before I noticed it stopped, so hopefully it was nothing missing was, it's getting me into doing different genres of music. I said I want to do some cinematic stuff, and then even then I just like recently posted a piano piece, just a dark composition that I came up with, and uploaded it on YouTube. Like I usually want to do stuff like that, but I'm getting more into doing stuff like that due to this, you know, and this dope to me like it's another tool in the toolbox like I could the fact that I could do the drums and everything for me I probably could have did it before but not in the same way that I can now all I have to do is hit key mode and it has it up like pads right here so I'm really grateful for this I love it you know I still have my MK1 somebody said I should <laughs> give do a giveaway and put my signature on it that's a that's a possible idea that I might do but I just I love this you know here we are one month later man this month flew by I have a lot of stuff coming up in the next month or so, so please stay in, stay tuned for that, stay watching for that, because I'm going to be all over the place, so yeah, <laughs> I appreciate y'all for tuning in, I hope you all enjoyed this video, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe, if you're not new, I just want to ask that you just continue to support me, thank you for watching, I appreciate you, take care.